Hi guys and welcome to another episode of Kabir Considers. In this video we're going to react to Idiots in Cars part 31. Who would have thought, you know, like three years ago when I watched the first Idiots in Cars video that I would get to 31 editions of it. Just shows you how entertaining these videos are, for me at least. And I know that a lot of you guys enjoy them too. There's just something about them that just makes me keep coming back. Whether it's the absolute boneheaded decisions people make behind the wheel sometimes, it's quite addictive. Okay. Oh! Break! Oh, man! Why the f are you looking at your phone, officer? Oh god, that poor guy. Oh man. Jeez. Dang. Oh no. Oh no. Oh the Lambo, not the Lambo. Uh-oh. Ooh. Oh, oh my god! That car got obliterated. Jesus! Woo! Oh my god! That SUV was a prick. He turned right out of nowhere. No blinker, no, you know, turn signal, nothing. No warning. Unless I missed it, he definitely didn't use his blinkers. Nothing. Wow. What an a-hole. Oh, he hasn't got it. He's coming back down. Oh, no. Could have been worse. Oh God, oh, oh my oh. God. Hey, whoa. Oh God. Oh no, don't go into the crowd. Ooh. Dang. <gasps> Oh my God. Ooh. Way too fast, dude. Why were you going so fast? Everybody's braking. Oh. <laughs> this poor guy, this poor guy. Minding his own business. She's climbed on the top of powers. Your champion is gonna be Ed the Holler. Oh, and then a huge crash there and he finished it straight. Uh oh. Oh. Oh my god, dude. What in the hell? Why, why was it, you know, all the way up? Oh, shit. Uh-oh, airbags went off. Yeah, this car is totaled probably. The way he was saying that. Uh oh. Uh oh. What the heck? What, what is this? Is this bobsledding? Oh my god, what a pilot. What a pilot. Oh my god. 
Look at this fool. You don't start turning before you put the turn signals on. You put the turn signals on and then you turn. Oh, look at this. Look at this dummy. Why do people struggle with that? Turn signals on at least two seconds before you turn. Oh God, oh God. You did it wrong. He don't know how to drive. <gasps> oh my god <laughs> and he crashed one idiot <laughs> i feel bad for the blue car though the blue car oh no oh no it honestly doesn't look too bad Yeah, it can be fixed, but it ain't going to be cheap. Oh, no. Oh. Oh, no. Oh, no. Is there a train coming? see a pile up aren't we we're about to see a pile up oh there you go oh my god damn what is this at least he tries at least he tried That was the slowest crash I've ever seen. Just inching slowly towards the fence. SUV doing what's he doing what is he doing that the, the SUV to the left was a fool for sure oh oh no oh the truck is gone disaster imagine if that thing was full of like flat screen tvs and they're all they're all destroyed Holy oh no oh my god oh you could feel that heat yeah you could Wow, look at this, it's airborne. Oh, sh Ooh. Uh oh. Uh oh, uh oh. Break, break. Oh, the guy, where was your attention? What were you looking at? You didn't see the cars?
Oh god. <laughs> Dang. Oh man. Super dangerous. Oh no, there it goes. Dude, get off it. Oh, oh no. Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> the way they were laughing. <laughs> Their laughs reminded me of Beavis and Butthead. You know, the <laughs> Uh oh, uh oh, oh no. Ooh. <sighs> now we have to wait. Does he have the talk? No, he doesn't have it. He doesn't have it. No. I think I think the cyclist is at fault here. He should have slowed down to see if it was clear. It's a bit of a blind spot, but still, you did not have right of way here, mate. Should have slowed down. Uh oh. Uh oh. Okay, I thought that was a ditch. No, it's not. Dang. What's that car doing? Is it break dancing or something? Like, <laughs> spinning around. Wow. I mean, very entertaining. It wasn't a pure car one. There was a lot of bikes. But, man, so many just absolute just boneheads. People that have no, no right, no reason to be on the road, really. Like, just crazy decisions. Like, how do you just turn? If the, unless the lane is empty, like, I think that's the only excuse for moving into a lane without using your indicators, your turn signals, as, as they call them in America. If there's cars in the other lane, if you don't use your turn signal, how is the other person going to know what you're about to do? And they haven't got enough time to adjust. Like, if you use your turn signal, it gives the person an idea. OK, he's going to move into my lane. Let me break a little bit, create a gap for him to move safely into. I just don't know why people don't think of it in that way. It just makes it so much safer. If you just turn into a lane and there's a car right there, you, it's just so dangerous. Like, why do people struggle? Just use your damn turn signals. Thanks for watching, guys, and I'll see you in the next one.